I will admit, I kind of find it interesting that they put this little compliment at the bottom of the screen. It always says the same thing. I'm pretty sure it always says, you look great today. Which on one hand, you'd be like, can you not put a different compliment? Like, I'm getting kind of bored of that one. On the other hand, obviously the metaphorical thing there is that you always look great. It's not about your current condition, about you as a person. And you as a person are always looking freaking fly. So in that case, it's actually probably the best set of compliments they could consistently give you on a day-to-day -day basis. So how about them apples? We have a mosquito. We have two guys who give honey who I don't like very much because they're literally just crickets. With like an extra step. Because they have to like eat the thing, they summon the dude, and then they summon the dude. They like pre-warn that they're going to summon a bee instead of just doing the cricket. They don't even have the element of surprise like a cricket does if you've never seen one before. Peculiar astronauts. Flexible arms. Juicy fangirls. Mm -hmm. Flexible astronauts. I feel like that might kind of be like a thing that makes literally no sense because astronauts would generally be inside those big old suits, right? And those big old suits allow, I would assume, approximately 0% flexibility or access to, I don't even know, bending your arms. But if they're just inside, they're just inside the spacecraft. They could like spin in circles really fast. Maybe they could get some sort of a flexibility action going on there. I could Tengren you, and then you could level, and that could be good. Mmm, you know what? Better him. And now we've got the 2-1-2 situation, which is a strategy in terms of having two of the same thing. One dude and two of the other same thing. They're also doing the 2-1-2. It's a classic maneuver. Theirs happens to be a dude who actually synergizes with them himself. But I killed one using my superior mosquito technology. And that makes all the difference. Mmm, you guys, yes. Was this good? Your bone now? That's 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 quite tasty, yes. You guys could also get together. You wouldn't- Ah! Okay, I did that, I didn't mean to. I was like, you wouldn't level though, and then I tried to put him down, but my finger slipped because I got nervous. I'm sorry, dude, that you're half leveled. I was just so freaking nervous. They left space and still put that guy up front. They wanted him in front so bad that they went four squatted. I mean, I can appreciate the commitment. Me not thinks it's worth, was not worth. In fact, mine was worth. Having one dude with a meat bone, kind of awesome. Yes. I don't, I don't, I don't like any of these people. I mean, he's kind of, you know what? You can exist. I'm not doing the, the, the fish who's amazing thing right now. So I guess everything else can exist for a second. I guess there's toys. I haven't noticed them very much, probably because I don't care for them and therefore choose to not look at them very hard. This guy's gonna get scaling from the dromedary. So I continue to think it's not that really good of a unit, so I'm surprised by his, um, I guess, vast amount of followers. However, at least this guy will get a little bonus when I stack that dude on him. I think he might have already was going to get that little bonus anyway of just a plus one plus one, but now it feels like I had some say in the matter, so I feel like as a coach I can take more credit for the fact that this was helpful. Have a brother. I could even hold this brother for an extra turn if I thought that was helpful. Mmm, you're the worst. I'm sorry, not like ever, just of the team. I wouldn't want you to think that you're like so horrible in life. I would hang out with you, just not part of this group, you know. We only have five tickets to the concert, okay? Things gotta go down. This is not that scary because he has no attack, so he actually basically didn't matter. That sucked. There's no summoning dude tools to put on my freaking hedgehog, though, so we can't even do draw stuff. There's no bees and there's no monkeys. Damn right there's no monkeys. If there were monkeys, I would have freaking noticed because I love them. I don't like your continued existence. A ton. Maybe a little bit. Maybe I like it a little bit. I don't want to lie to myself. You were cool when that guy had a honey, but he doesn't have it anymore. Okay, I'm not- I see what they're saying here. I, I understand what they're saying. But I don't- I'm not doing the sturgeon. And last time- while that did get pretty cool once I actually started being able to use it, it took me so long to be able to use it <laughs> that I feel like the, the commitment, it was not worth. In the long term, it was not worth. This is stink. It's fine. It's fine. None of you people can survive me. I'm only drawing, which is like not the coolest, but it's better than simply losing. <laughs> I would much rather draw and say nothing happened and I never went to the contest than lose and have that posted in the school newspaper. Nothing matches. 
you know what? I love this man. He's our best unit. And so you say, sell him, you say. You want me to sell him? Is, is that what you, audience member, the one person watching the video, you want me to sell him? Okay, then. It's all up to you now. I, I personally will blame you and I will cry in your face if we lose. It will be your fault. Tomorrow, the mosquito is gone for the skunk. We can only have one white slash gray slash black person on the team at one time. So his gray is going to get switched out for the skunk. Otherwise, I'll get, you know, the, the team needs to stay colorful in order for me to stay awake. Otherwise, it's a hot snooze fest and I can't keep it up. Okay, this snail mascot, of which I have no mascots, the snail one is the cutest though. I think it's probably the one I want the most. And look, they gave me a bonus. There's literally no reason for me to continuously have this thing happening here because I that's never going to let me win. I put a pineapple on there. It could be kind of close though. Where is a deer going, you silly? I guess on the hatching chick spot. Dog pile. Is this literally because they've already got like a money pile, don't they? This is like dog treats. I will admit these dog treats kind of look like little fluffy clouds as if someone also ripped a bunch of toys up in here, which seems kind of like it might be toxic for the dogs, but whatever. Hedgehog out here pulling out some sweet draws. We will never die. We will also never win. What does that mean? It means here we are in eternity. I hope you got comfortable because we're never going to leave. Yes. I mean, you look good. One free shop and give one. No, you know. Mm, yeah. Well. You know what? If everything else, I'm going to say we have the squad. I'm going to say the squad is decided. <laughs> look at all these dudes I want. I want you the most. And then here's him. I That's quite a delicious snack, though, isn't it? I'm sorry, everyone. I am so sorry, everyone. Life is pain. <laughs> we are in limbo and life is pain. And the decisions I have to make, I do not take layer lightly. I take them extremely lightly because it is a video game. And, I, and it's like, well, you know, at the end of the day, I could just start another round. But no! As soon as I verbalize the fact that, you know, what is this but a video game, I lose. My first lost heart. Possibly my second, because I probably gained that first one back, like, artificially. But, you know, I'm going to say that it's not that. Mm -hmm. I am now welcoming chocolate onto my... Mm -hmm. Okay, well, that's fine. Only feed him, please. I was going to say a two out of three ain't bad. Technically speaking, I think that is a C, which in some parents' eyes would be a fail. In realistic and kind of lame for them to say that, but <laughs> it's not the greatest. <laughs> that team actually felt a little more similar to mine than one would expect, and then we still lost. Tragedy, yes. Do I actually want you more than him? Is he doing anything? Good question. Is he doing anything? If I put him at the front of the team, he would do six damage to everyone, which could defeat if they were like a turkey team or something that could be chill, but then I'd have to be chill with my own self being hot injured. If I give myself all of the oranges, you could argue that's actually kind of a decent idea. One dude. Double damage once. Get out there and do 10 damage to one person, which probably will not kill, but you can feel like you contributed more before your inevitable death. He, he almost, he didn't get to use his croissant thing, actually. It didn't even work. Even if it had worked, it still wouldn't have done it. But it was close. <laughs> I don't think this hedgehog has actually killed everyone in, like, a few turns. So maybe it is approximately time to be like, mm, I, I don't know if this concept is going as well as we had all hoped it would. I would like to replace you with someone delicious. Mm. Someone delicious, you say? Yes? Yes. And to him, he is weird because this guy is supposed to be our god. He's supposed to be our, our like, our definer. Um, except in this run, I actually never made a definer. I just kind of started doing stuff. I've been switching people out rapid fire. I guess the hedgehog was the definer and I just completely ignored him uh, and his existence. He's gone now. So first win of the season. You could say the hedgehog wasn't here that turn. So maybe it was him that whole time. Yes. I mean, yes. Mmm, finally, that guy took frickin' forever to level, didn't he? I guess I could start switching people. Because you're gonna get more health anyway. Yeah, let's make this guy our attacking dude. 
I think that they switched it so like the stuff like this dude's random peanut draw prefers to go to people who don't already have something. That could be a complete lie. I actually have not a strong amount of idea if that's the truth. But if it is the case, then he could be the attack guy because everyone else who doesn't have something already is going to get the attack guy by having the penis anyway. So, you know, like everyone is the attack guy. But then who's the healthy guy? It's him, you see? It all comes together. We only ever wanted one healthy guy. Mmm... yes? Yes. And I don't care for these, so that's fine. You're gonna give six to one dude? Is that a- is that a good- is that- that feels different. He- he really is favoring the eel. This is why you might want a donut. I have never actually ever wanted a donut in this game before. But if they gave me one, I don't think they were in the weekly. If they did, I would actually buy one. New grounds would be crossed today if only they gave it a shot. <laughs> okay, the draws, they are infinite. What turn is it? 20, you say? 15? Nowhere close. It's actually not nearly as far into the game as one might think. You know what? Yes. Oh, I forgot to save people. It's fine. Somebody else gets to switch. It's you. Okay, so the peanuts is not favoring random dudes because he just kind of keeps giving it to him, but he has pineapples. Probably he's had pineapples for longer than I remember. That sucks. That that also was a bit sneaky. Have you considered that this guy is going to have double, double peanuts? I didn't think about that. Mm, double peanuts. So freaking tasty. You eat it twice. That sounds gross. Sounds like you're going to like barfed into your hand and then ate it again. I can't fit this many friends. You don't need to be leveled. Irrelevant. Him or him? That could go somewhere. In fact, he's already doing two. You know what? This guy's maxed. Suave. Ooh, there's him, but mm, yes, yes, yes. More than the moose, I think, yes. It's not going to be a good turn for actually giving the health out. Only the skunk got it, but he needed it. I gave him a lollipop earlier, so, you know, he had a sweet and he was looking for some salty, such as the peanuts. Boom, there it is. Now you'll win us the game by result of the fact that I've given you your cravings. Mm, that's how it works. Victory, I do be claiming it. Yes and yes. I don't... Okay, that's a great shop. Oh my god, they've given me everything I've ever asked for and also more, you say? Yes, and a walrus. Amazing. This is going to be the healthiest day ever. I think that's just... I think he just favors the dude standing next to him, honestly. Which, can you blame a guy? It's probably a lot more convenient to throw to him than to him. If I was trying to throw my little health packs around and I threw it to a far guy and missed, that would be so embarrassing. Everyone would think that I wasn't a very reliable healer. Kind of like how teachers will only call on the people in class who they know the name of because they don't want to just get the other guy wrong, resulting in the dudes with the most basic ass names getting called constantly. This is nice. I don't think anyone wants a peanut. Which feels weird because like I just feel like I love the peanut. Does anybody want this? If I leveled him and then got his attack slightly up, which would have to come from a magic place that's non-existent because I don't know how I'd possibly do that. You can have more attack. Look at all these cool things we have happening. Ooh, that stinks, but it's fine, actually. I care minimally. These stink a little bit more. The boar being on the team would be cool. The skunk wants to get lollipoped again. He's almost maxed. It's a tasty time. Oh my god, the stats on this enemy team are impossible. If I just had all the peanuts, even now. Even now. The Chili's is the opponent of the peanuts, and sadly I had none and they had all. Nobody wants this. The truth. Nobody wants this because it is the truth, and the truth is scary. Yes, yes, give me a lollipop. Mmm, a lollipop. One piece of candy. Booyah. I didn't do anything for Halloween, which is lame because it's like at one point is our holidays become became lame, and that's when you realize that holidays never had any imbued magic. It's not like a day just is fun for the sake of nothingness. It's only fun because you plan events and you do things about it. Usually your parents do, and then it becomes your responsibility. I didn't go anywhere for Halloween. I didn't do anything. I attempted to do the pumpkin photo shoot where you carve a pumpkin and put it on your head and put like a fancy outfit on and then you're all like fancy pants. But our pumpkins got really rotty before we could take the photo so I didn't get to fully on do that. I almost did something for Halloween. No, that still counts. It's kind of like a fall thing. It, it took a second. It happened a bit ago. You? 
Is this good for us? We've only got one of these dudes. Please just give me a few more all of a sudden. Um, all of a sudden they didn't do what I asked. I didn't even dress up or anything. I, I even, I didn't even buy candy because I'm so lame. I mean, not for kids, obviously. I knew they weren't going to be any here, but I was like, oh, I should have bought candy for me to eat on Halloween so I can renew that. No, it was the worst. Ultimate sniper squad in, mm, come on. They even killed my eel. Damn, that's so much damage. They were able to kill my eel without even attacking? Like, Jesus. No, unless they just hit him once with the... I guess it was probably the lynx, actually. Because I'm like, yeah, is it even physically possible to have that much pure... Just unfiltered damage? A thing! I got a mask. Remaining unlockables, 40. How many of those are backgrounds? Because honestly, I'm a little lacking on the backgrounds. Duck. Duck. Goose. Mm, you know what? He is actually a bee, so he gets to sit in the back. I was just gonna do it because like the game gave me the option which is why you do most things in a game but now i think maybe my actual own decision making was part of that legendary planets motherly poets peculiar pieces legendary pieces motherly poets poets who are in fact motherly i think i mean poetry is mostly about having emotions and making metaphorical writing right although i do feel like a lot of people who go into poetry it's people with strong negative emotions who are most inclined to be getting the emotions out so I guess it seems less motherly and more like my sad older sibling who's seen more shit than I have and has grown up alongside my parents is writing poetry to vent about the fact that those things have happened and I've not experienced those, so I don't fully understand, but that's what they're doing. And less like a mom, but whatever. Um, I was talking too fast. I did not mean to combine that many dudes, but now we've got a slightly larger duck. Please do the work of two individual sized ducks. I am a little afraid that it's not going to go down. Mm. I'd like to say we almost didn't die horribly, um, but that otter was weirdly statted. Probably because he seemed to be quite leveled. It is turn three. Give me things that are good. You know what? I'd do it. It is early enough that if they- w I'm gonna take a second stab. Oh, and this actually synergizes! Can I put the dude, the bug, behind him? He's not actually gonna get any more attacks, so the bug probably should be behind the duck to give him health, actually. Because the melon breaking doesn't count as taking damage, so it shouldn't trigger the silk moth. Ignoring that fact, I still did a synergy. And it was one of very few synergies you can actually do this early in the game for this weekly, so that actually feels pretty frickin' tasty. Nothing. Nothing appeals to me except this, because it's literally what I was looking for. Thank you. You need to be behind that. Him being so far back feels weird, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Are we um, able to get moles? No? Okay, we're gonna do the mole thing. Which is where you put it in front of this guy so that he can eat... He can eat his uh, things that happen when he dies. The melons. He can eat his melons. I don't... I don't want you to get better. You know what? This guy, though. Behind him. And that dude's thing. I think I'm gonna level him tomorrow. I hope that we just get a mole, because that's what I want to be in front of this dude. So if we just got a mole, that would be cooler. Although he has to be in front then. Mm. This is fine. Ooh, they've got two dromedaries. They are, they are, something's happening in the back. Luckily, I don't have to fight what's happening in the back, theoretically. But, you know, someone in the future is going to have to fight some very statted, suddenly baby guy. Hey, my dolphin's healthier than yours. Should have signed him up for Pilates. It's been really good for us these days. I will level you now in the sake of give me cool things. You know what? Actually, upgrades. Upgrades. I don't want you to please stop freaking showing up. You're freaking out my neighbors. I don't want you to level either. I would like to not have half of the shop frozen because it's making it probably a lot more difficult for me to find moles. Hmm. I'm doing it anyway because I just like the things you're giving me. I, I just too many things. Like I hate him. Silk Moth off the team. Level because just I I have to. But after he's leveled, off the team. The dolphins are really pulling it out though. Thank God for these dolphins and honestly for the sea turtle for enabling said dolphins. Okay, you're here and you're gone now. This dude's here. This has to be like this. I know it feels weird, but that's what's going on. Mm-hmm. Yes. This is. More worth the, to me than the links. 
And now we just need everyone to be leveling. <laughs> Delicious. We can see this work once. We will have one 6-6 six, six moth, making this effectively an 8-9. He will kill one man. Two men. Two entire men. Twice his size, if not greater. Respectable. We have a deer who fears the dolphins when you've got a land mammal who is part robot. Who can summon robotic needs. Okay, this dude's cool now. Now you can't be where you are because we don't have space. So we have to do it like this. Unfortunate. Highly unfortunate because I really wish the mole was further ahead, but this is what we've got. And I think that that's what we're going to stick with. I don't like any of you guys. Bye, give faint dudes. Oh, we actually have like a bunch of faint dudes. This is one of the few times this guy would actually do something. And I'm not even going to do it because like, what do I have to gain from that? Negative one guy on my squad. I like the dudes on my squad. I ain't gonna sell him for like three stat numbers. I ain't that cheap. Ooh, can you kill one dude? Oh, you almost got one dude. Did oh, he ate his chili! Did the mole die before the bus? Was that weird? He's still coming. It's fine. I mean, this guy leveling is definitely God. So he died before that. So I have to make sure this guy... Okay, stop leveling the ox. He doesn't matter. Him having additional levels literally changes nothing for us. I kind of want things that matter more. Like this. Thank you. I appreciate the thought. Mm -hmm. Our beluga surgeon in each level 3 means minimal. I don't think we can fit three dolphins on this team with any sort of uh, reasonable... Ah, stop killing this stuff that I still like all the time. Was he able to summon? He was. weird if the deer and the mole die at the same time the deer is still summoning the bus before the mole uses his thing so he is stealing his chili if they die at the same time which is like curious that it just keeps happening like that because you think normally they wouldn't keep dying at the exact same time i would like you to be on the team even more than my newly level tootsie turtle I don't know. Decisions in life are hard. I'm just a simple soul. I see the objective. It's- it's- it is gonna suck really hard for me. You're gonna kill my mole. Did you steal- no, okay. He didn't steal the buses that time. The bus died first. It's only in the summoning order, I suppose. And this is still decent. My team is scaling 0%. Um, there is no scaling happening. There's only- ever getting closer to this one thing I'm trying to do actually functioning as it's supposed to. I don't know if that's going to be a problem in the future. You know what, Sea Turtle, you're boring. I want to do this in the back. It feels gross, doesn't it? I guess I want this in the back. Maybe he can eat the enemy buses, but my deer was eating the enemy's buses. But if he's going to get a mushroom, he's going to want to be back there anyway at some point, I suppose. Can I have a mushroom, please? Can I have one sassy little mushroom? You stink. They never have what I want. Maybe because I always want everything on the menu except slightly changed, which probably peeves off the chefs a little bit. But come on. Can a girl refuse to eat anything that isn't a variant on pizza nowadays? It seems like, come on. Oof. <laughs> the bus just looks so weirdly naked when it doesn't have its chili on it. Like, it feels unnatural. So the chill thing... If I put this guy back up here... You can actually summon three, and that lets this guy do his thing three times. I don't like how far back he is, but that actually sounds like it might be worth it. You, you know, even more than him getting to level 2, which is also quite dandy, the mole just getting there. I mean, this whole team was built off the mole actually doing something, so I would like two attempts to make him succeed in life. Okay, have you considered a billion buses? They have. They themselves are actually also running a bajillion buses. Mole, it's your only chance. Frick. Wait, no, frick. It looked a little closer than you expected. It looked a little closer than I expected, and I can basically see the future, so it should definitely have been a surprise to everyone else. You could be saucy. I don't think there's any protective gear this weekly. So it's probably fine. 
I I'm like vaguely interested in like nothing. Oh, chocolate. Chocolate. I remember chocolate. I'm trying to feed it to my mole. My mole, who's supposed to be my defining unit, who's stuck at the back of the squad. It stinks. It's still pretty stink. This is the worst. It, it might be the worst. It's a little stinky. This guy not being level three. If I were to describe that, I would call it not very helpful. I would describe it as not very helpful. You know, what are you going to do? Fight me about it? You can have some oranges. I mean, sure. Thank God. I know that this is here and cool. I've also never had that before, so that's chill. If the enemy could simply stop killing all of my dudes before the party starts, then something amazing will go down. 1818? What? I thought this guy was supposed to summon 32 32s this whole time. Was that someone doing a turkey thing? Am I supposed to have a turkey on this team? Was I doing this wrong this whole time? The um, infinite quantity of buses keeps killing my ox, which doesn't feel like it should be that easy because I feel like he's got a decent amount of personal strength, but maybe it's because everyone else has infinite um, health scaling and instead of scaling, I've chosen to have this boar and I don't regret it because it's any cute, but it's probably, it's not, it could be better maybe to have had any attempt at scaling up until this point. I'll admit that. I hate life because life hates me too. He's still gonna do his thing once. It wasn't enough. <laughs> okay, we got to turn seven with that though, and I think that's better than the last attempt at doing the mole thing. So I don't think I've I've been able to successfully make that happen, but we've trialed it. There's the new technology that everyone's been raving about. I'm sure that if I didn't refuse to let go of one dolphin, it might have been better to scoot him up forward and put some of you guys in the back. That could have been cool, but whatever.